Michael, many congratulations. Cheers, lad. I can see by that smile you're over the moon with your performance. Yeah, um, I've said it over and over again. I put all my eggs in one basket this year. I just won that TV major. I kind of uh, give up on pro tours and Europeans. I took them lightly, but lucky enough, I'm playing half decent on TV. Made a few finals, a couple of semis. I just need that one better now and get the win. 5-1, but it should have been 5-0 if we're being honest. That. Uh, no, 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 because he gave me the first leg, then he missed two dice before I did, so kind of evened itself out. And then, luckily enough, I managed to put in back to back 11s and kill him off. Really. Again, the average going into the last leg, I'm guessing you didn't know how good it was. Not until RTL just told me then if I would have hit that double four in the last leg, that would have took the, the record, but records are only there to be broken, they don't win your matches. So as long as I win the match, I don't, I don't give a rook by monkeys. I like the averages. Nathan's obviously in great form as well, so going into the game, you knew you had to be your very best. Yeah, when um, when I tweeted saying I love easy draws, I was I was really scared of playing Nathan, especially after Vegas. Sorry about his word. Yeah, but he told me he told him to me in Vegas, and I could see the first few legs, he battered me. And I, that's what I wanted to prove then. Started a bit slow, but then my 180 started running in my 140s, and I think I was just a bit too strong for him then. In the group of death, as it was dubbed, you've come out of there the first opportunity, so that must please you as well. Yeah, I was in the group of death last week as well in the Champions League, and I still got through that. But no, I just came, just, just winning matches, that's what. It means to me, it's just even if I'm playing junior or my mum or Stevie Wonders, yeah, as long as I win, that's that's the main thing. That's I don't go into a match. Any any sports won't go into a match going, oh, I'll let him win. I can't be bothered. You go into every match wanting to win. It's just how much you believe in yourself and speaking to you over the years, you know how much confidence and how much belief I actually do have in myself. And it is annoying that I've never won anything major. It's that's what's really getting on my nerves. Again, you scan back to your TV form and putting all your eggs in one basket. Right now, you're on top form, which is unrare for you because normally you go under the radar a little bit. But now your game is right at the very top. Um, it is over the last two games it has been. <laughs> uh, if you look at last week in the <coughs> what was it, last week the World Series, yeah. I was garbage, and then semi-finals in the Europeans, I was garbage. So it is uh, just I need that consistency and. Looking at uh, yesterday's game and today's game, the consistency is there. I'm improving. I don't think I can prove much on that one, but as long as I can keep it over the 100 mark, I'll be happy. The last group game, Nathan and Glenn in a straight shootout to see who comes through with you. If it was to be Glenn, he spoke early and said he thought you were a little bit disrespectful in your comments yesterday. Would you like a, a crack at the quarterfinal with him again? Not really, no. You you put the words into my mouth. Uh, no, <laughs> not being disrespectful. It's just. <laughs> It was one of the things, it, you can't, for me, the the Grand Slam is 32 players. You get to a final, or you, you win it, or you run up, you're in. You can't leave one organisation and come to another and expect to get in for the one you just left. But that's my opinion, it's not only mine. There's a lot of people think the same, and if he thinks it's disrespectful, good luck to him. I, I'm just, I'm not here to, I'm not here to make friends. I, I like Glenn, I really do. But I'm here to put food on the table for my kids, I'm here to win titles and I'm here to win matches. I'm not here to make friends. Michael, wish you all the very best tomorrow night against Manchin. <laughs> Pleasure as always, lad. Cheers, lad.